Alrighty, boys, this is where the trip's gonna start. We're gonna take about a week, and we're gonna take off out of Amarillo in one of these things. We'll rent one of these. Not bad between all of us. And uh, enough room for everybody to be comfortable. From there, we're gonna take off, end up uh, skirting Denver, and end up in Wyoming there. And uh, this is gonna be our first stop right here. I don't know how to pronounce this town in Wyoming's name, but it's just a good place to grab a hotel room after driving 13 hours straight, you know what I mean? And which we can all switch off. But anyways, after that, we're going to take off the next morning. And uh, uh, y'all might have heard of this place. Um, it's it's a fairly well known Yellowstone National Park. All right. We're going to, uh, you know, just spend that next day exploring, um, taking in Yellowstone, doing a little bit of fishing, maybe, you know, should be beautiful. Um, and that night we can, uh, that next night we can either stay in Yellowstone National Park or we can keep going somewhere into Montana even, um, because we got kind of a long ways to go yet. We're going to take off up through Montana. We could stay anywhere in here the next night, you know, looks like it's probably hard to miss a badass place to, uh, camp. And, uh, Basically, our goal is to make it all the way up through there, and uh, this is the spot right here, uh, Clark, Clark Fork, nice little river. This is the panhandle of Idaho, so uh, we're up close to the Canada border, and uh, it's beautiful, and this is what we're going to be chasing around. This is a bull trout. Uh, they're native there, and they're huge, very predatory, chase big lures. And they like to eat stuff like the native cutthroat. These are some cutthroat right here. We can fish for these too. They take dry flies really well. Beautiful fish. But another thing the panhandle of Idaho has is uh, three different species of grouse. And so we're going to be up there in grouse country. And you can hunt them anywhere. It's all public land. If you see one cross the road, you just get out and hunt it. This is a spruce grouse. They also have dusky grouse. And this is a rough grouse. And shout out to Gus uh, with our small game license, which is cheap. We can hunt squirrels, too. So, anyways, uh, Clark Fork, uh, this is all public hunting stuff right here. This is dirt roads going through the mountains. Um, we're just making our way through here. Uh, this is It takes a long time because these are slow-going roads, but we're hunting the whole time. We're having fun. There's little creeks through there. We can fish, all that stuff. And then this is our kind of destination is where we're going to spend like our main three days of camping. This is Lake uh, Pend Oreilly, and it is beautiful. It is a high mountain lake, high altitude, crystal clear, deep. It's like 1,100 something feet deep. And uh, it's just beautiful, crystal clear, all public camping. We don't have to have a campsite. We're just going to walk in there and do something like this. You know what I'm saying? We're just vibing right there on the beach. And this is what we're fishing for in the lake. M -m -m monster fucking rainbows big daddy rainbows uh loads of lake trout every trout you can imagine lives in this lake uh and there's also huge walleye and uh huge pike as well all right after our three nights on the lake uh we're gonna take off going back down through idaho this time all that forest road we just drove through we'll be hunting and enjoying ourselves um we get down here and this is just more like world famous rivers and stuff to fish out of Idaho. I mean, we can stop wherever everybody wants to stop or not. We're just having fun. Uh, this is St. Joe River. I really think we need to hit that. That's got really big bull trout, and it's just like the clearest river in existence. It's incredible. Keep on making our way down through Idaho, and uh, I don't know. Wherever y'all want to stay, we can stay. But then eventually we're going to make it to our uh, second big destination. This is in Utah. And this is Fish Lake. It's beautiful. Another high altitude lake. Um, really super clear. And the spearfishing regs are incredible. And this time of year, this is what's up close to the bank. Big fat daddy mama lake trout. Big brook trout. All the trouts again, and then uh, there's also tiger muskie, which are just incredible. And look, this guy shot one with a spear gun. So, anyways, uh, spend a night there, a day and a half or whatever, playing, and then we'll just make our way back to Amarillo, turn the car back in.
Boys Trip 2024.